Okay, hi everyone. So welcome to week four. What I think is really nice about week four is that it is a bit of a departure from what we've been doing the last um, three weeks, which is working towards um, our first assignment, which is due um, today, Monday at five o'clock. Australian Eastern Daylight Savings Time. And this week is all about getting to know your team that you'll be working with um, for the final assignment. It's a, bit, it's a bit in the future, but I think it's good to kind of start and think about what sort of things you value when you work in a team and get to know your team members and see what sort of um, compromises and different methods of, the, of communication that work for you. Um, so you'll be completing the team charter where you can write your team's name, write the team members, and then you can talk about different sorts of goals um, that your team wants to have. So you, maybe you want to get a distinction standard for the assignment or um, maybe completing all the different tasks within the assignment on time. I think it's really cool how there's also measures of success within this assignment. So um, a goal needs to be measurable, it needs to be achievable, and it needs to be timely, right? So you can say... Um, that a way in which you're going to make sure that all assignment tasks are completed on time is by having um, designated roles and responsibilities and regular team meetings to keep that accountability going and have an open channel of communication between each team member. Um, you'll also be able to talk as well in this week about your strengths and weaknesses. So you can say, I'm really good at, say, critical thinking and I'm really good at um, problem solving and very agile in terms of how I think. However, I'm not the best at organisation and probably someone else would be better at, say, timekeeping in our meetings or they would be better at recording the notes and the, um, the minutes in the meeting. All those sorts of things are, um, are essential in creating um, a really effective team where everyone has their ideal preferred role or contribution. Um, so yeah, you'll be working through that team charter this week, which I think is really, really good. Um, and then you'll also be responding to the questions about what tools will your team use to communicate and work together. I don't mind if you use Facebook groups, if you use uh, like a, mess a message thread, email, if you want to use the Canvas, if you want to use Canvas. I don't really mind. It's up to you how your team wants to communicate. I'll be dropping in um, and kind of uh, seeing how everyone is going just through Canvas messages um, as we continue throughout the teaching period. But I probably won't start doing this in earnest until after we submit the essay. Essay. or after we submit the yeah, probably the essay and then I'll start to um, drop in and get some um, kind of uh, updates and where you all are at okay so I'm looking forward to seeing what how you all go as first meeting your team so I posted the teams um, in an announcement last Friday um, so you can have a look in that um, I'll also post that announcement um, in this as well underneath if, in case anyone has not seen it. Okay, cool. Thanks, guys.